guys, it's Aubrey here uh, with another planner-ish related video. I finally got all my stuff packed in my bag. Um, and you can see my sock there. You can probably see my dog walking through. They're both in the room with me today because my little one is being extremely needy. <laughs> extremely needy. So I have it all packed up in my decline. You can see a little tag there. Um... It's like a, um, I just had the word, can't think of what it's called now, um, toiletries case, right? So, I have my, um, jelly roll pens, um, in their little container, so, I put in some of them upside down so they fit better. So I just stuck that in, and then um, I have, I got out, like, my two collections of kind of pens. So I see my big fat Ink Joy, are these Ink? No, these are Big Velocities. I have those um, on one side because I had extra room, and then these are my Ink Joys. I have over here my Ink Joy set that I got, and then my just my random pens. Uh... They're shoved in these little two little pockets here. As you can see, this is kind of crowded, but it's got plenty of extra room. I could put in more pens into that. You know, there's a gap like that big. I could put more pens in it. And then I have the rest of them over here. The only reason this one is in here because I don't have any ink refills for it right now. And then, as you can see, I have my, I just have my little diary sitting in here. Um, I believe this will be big enough for the larger Hobonichi 2, which I've ordered as my diary for next year. Or just whenever this one's full. Um, it should fit in here. I can always rearrange if it doesn't. And then I have my marker pack. My paper mate. Um, marker pack, which I don't actually really use a whole lot for my diary, but I'm going to be uh, picture doing pictures and stuff more now, so I wanted to have that. And then I broke this, um, this pin case out, and this has my collection of Stabilos in it, uh, which are also good for coloring in my diary if I chose to do so. They also work great for writing because they're such a fine tip. Um, and then, even though I don't really use it uh, for coloring in, and yeah, this is where the problem comes in. Take that out and everything falls apart. I also have my owl pencil case, and this is what has all of my um, twistable colored pencils are in this one. And I put those in there because I really planned on using it for my adult coloring books as well, but they won't fit. But now it's just kind of, I guess, to get it kind of out of the way um, for now because, well, I don't want to lose it and everything, you know, so, eh, I, I just don't know. It might come out. I mean, I don't really see myself using it in my planner. Because I have much more vivid colors that I can use um, to do things with. But it's going to stay in there for a minute. And then in here, in my little clear pack, if you can see, I have a pencil sharpener. Oh, I have a loose pencil down at the bottom of this, too, if you can see it. And then I have my fountain pens, and then I have all the refills for my fountain pens, and then the refill for my, um, shoot, what is it? my one pen I have with me all the time. It's my doctor grip I have in my purse. And then I have my single roll of washi tape back here. And then I have a pad of paper, um, Sanex, um, shoot, what is it? It's the, the French Bulldog. And then a couple of stickers I had. So until this gets fuller with like stickers and washi tape, I'm just gonna leave the refills in there and stuff in case, you know, they break or explode or whatever. And, um, and my dog is whining because he wants in the chair with my big dog. But, um, yeah, I wanted to have a little extra protection around it, whatever, so that, um, 
that way if they explode or whatever, it doesn't ruin a whole lot. And since I only have one washi tape thing in there, and and I'm not too too worried about this Sanex thing getting ruined. I mean, it, once I get glue and stuff, I probably will start putting little notes and junk in my planner, but I don't have that right now. So this all fits fairly nicely in here. I do have it packed pretty well. So then we'll just zip it back up. Et voila. Um, actually, I should check and see if the big one fits in here because I have a big one still. I'm waiting for the big one I ordered too. Um, maybe I'll, I'll probably stick them both in there once I get it. But anyway, guys, thank you so, so much for watching. I appreciate you staying until the end. I hope you found that maybe interesting or a little bit helpful in case you don't want to get a bag with all the different pockets or you want something that's a little less expensive. This is probably actually as expensive as the ones that most people are getting at like Target or whatever. I think it was $25, which is a, a bit for such a tiny bag, but it accomplished the goal I wanted it to and it looks cute. So, I mean, that's really... You know, really all that I had intended for it. So, um, there it is. And my Maddie's getting up now. Mwah. Say hi, Maddie. No? Alright, so, thank you guys so, so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed it. Leave a like, comment, yeah. suggestions, anything down in the description, uh, description box. Yeah down in the comments section um and i will catch you guys later hang in there it'll get better bye bye